Please be something cool. Earphones. I wonder what ability this is gonna be. I guess I should try them out. Morning, honey. Oh, hey, mom. I have to tell her she's adopted. Did you just say I'm adopted? No, I didn't say that, honey. What do you mean? I'm going to school. Hey, Giselle. Oh, hey, Olivia. I'm just friends with her so I can hook up with her boyfriend. You know what? This friendship is over. What? Is it something I said? I think these give me the ability to know what people are thinking. Sweet. Giselle, you're failing this class. You got an F on your test. Well, Mr. Fitz, is there anything I could do for extra credit? Oh, she could suck on my... You know what? I'm fine with failing. This is both a blessing and a curse. What object am I getting today? A pair of glasses? What kind of ability is that? I guess I should try them on. Morning, honey. Oh, hey, mom. Wait, you used to be a stripper? How do you know that? Don't judge me. No, I'm not. I'm going to school. No way, these tell me people's darkest secrets. Hey, Giselle. You slept with my dad? What? No! Don't ever talk to me again! Since when do you wear glasses? Since this morning. You know, you should really stop crushing on teachers. What? Giselle, come on, please just go out with me. Tyler, for the tenth time, no! Oh shit! I can finally see my parents' bank account. Although I don't expect them to make much, we can barely afford the house we live in. What? My parents are millionaires? That means they can buy me my new phone. Hey mom. Hey dad. What's up sweetie? Um, can you guys please buy me the new iPhone? The new iPhone? <laughs> are you crazy? But why? There's no way we can afford that. Hey Giselle, what's wrong? Is it possible for the system to show you the wrong amount of what your parents make? No, the system is always accurate. Why do you ask? Well, because it says my parents are millionaires, and they can't even buy me a new phone. We also can barely afford the house we live in. I think you need to talk with them about it. Mom, Dad, you guys are millionaires. Why are we living in this crappy house? I think we should tell her. Mom, Dad, you guys are millionaires. Why are we living in this crappy house? I think we should tell her. Tell me what? Sweetie, you're adopted. I'm adopted? Are you serious? Honey, we wanted to tell you. I can't believe you guys were keeping this from me this long. I have to go. Hey Jessica, can I please come sleep over at your house? I'm having some family issues. Yeah, of course. Thanks. Thank you so much for letting me stay here. Your family has a really nice house. I don't think I've ever met your parents before. They're usually gone for business trips. Jessica, come downstairs. They're back. Let's go say hi. Mom, Dad, this is my best friend Giselle. Hi, Mr. and Miss Smith. You look oddly familiar. No, surely it can't be. Mom, Dad, this is my best friend Giselle. Hi, Mr. and Miss Smith. You look oddly familiar. No, surely it can't be. Jessica, can I talk to you alone for a second? Is that okay, Giselle? Yeah, okay. Hey, I'm back. Oh, you're done talking to your parents? What did they say? They think you're their long-lost daughter. Crazy, right? Um, no. Actually, it's not crazy. My parents told me this morning that I'm adopted. Really? We need to go tell my parents right away. Mom, Dad, Giselle has something to tell you. My parents told me this morning that I was adopted. So you guys may be my biological parents. We need to go take a test to be sure. Yeah, let's go. The DNA test results just came back. Giselle, you are. Please choose the nice outfit. Are you kidding me? It's picture day. 
All right, Brianna, come up. You're next. No. Get ready to smile for your picture in three, two, one. Are you ready for the test? Of course. I literally studied all night long. You better let me write this test. Jerk. Miss, I have to leave. I can't write my test. I'm sorry. Why did you leave during the test? You said you were prepared. This is so humiliating. <laughs> Jake, why are you laughing so much? I just made my soulmate have the worst day of her life. Really? Yeah, I ruined her picture day, made her miss her test, and then I absolutely humiliated her. Well, you look scary. You. Today it's my turn to make the choices. Revenge is gonna be sweet. Oh, would you look at that? Looks like someone's missing basketball practice. You're the worst. You knew I had basketball practice. And you knew I had picture day. No, 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 please. I have to go to that class. I'm so close to failing. Yeah, and I really needed to write the test yesterday, too, so... Here, I bought you some cookies. Aw, you're bribing me. Uh, no, I'm just a nice guy. Well, you're lucky. Unlike you, I'm actually a good person. Woo, you can do this, Jake! <laughs> Woo, we won! I know! The other team, they didn't stand a single chance against you guys. Thanks for letting me play. I hope you can forgive me for being such a jerk. Oh, this is gonna be easy. Good morning, Mom. Good morning, sweetheart. Here. I made you lunch. You always know just how to brighten someone's day. <laughs> Hey, Mrs. K, that necklace looks absolutely stunning on you. Really? It does? My bully? No way! She doesn't deserve it! What are you wearing? <laughs> I know, it's so funny, right? I mean, like, what am I wearing? What am I wearing? You're acting strange. Hey, wanna know something so crazy? I've never actually seen you smile. Why don't you show me those pearly whites? <laughs> Okay! Hey, so I'm actually doing a survey for a class. I just need you to write down all the things that make you happy. I know what you're doing. You're trying to make me smile. It's not going to work. I haven't smiled one day in my entire life. There has to be something that makes you smile. No, nothing. All I see is darkness and the world crumbling around me. That's dark. I know! Let's go to that garden you like so much. You know, the one with all the... Decaying flowers? Yes, that place is nice. It stinks here! That would be all the rotting plants. This place makes you happy? Yes, I like it. The decaying flowers is like a metaphor for my life. Then why aren't you smiling? I'm so glad to be out of there. I can finally breathe again. Hey, has anyone ever told you how pretty you are? Flattery will get you nowhere. What am I gonna do? If I can't make you smile by the end of the week, my life is... Over. Okay, I'll smile if it means you're going to leave me alone. Yes, please. No. That's not a smile. Yes, it is. That's creepy. It's okay. I won't give up. Come with me. You're going to smile. I found a list of jokes on the internet, and I'm going to recite them to you until you smile. Why couldn't the pony sing a lullaby? Because he was a little horse. You have the humor of a brick wall. Once you see how pretty you look in this makeup, you are going to smile for sure. Don't put pink stuff on me. Okay, you're done then. Look in the mirror. Ah! What did you do to my face? Put this on. It's totally going to go with your makeup. No. What? Why? You don't like this sweater? It's literally my favorite one. I'm not interested in any of these things. You're only doing the things you like, and I'm nothing like you. You just like basically everything. I don't know what to do anymore. I give up. You're never going to smile. Oh! <laughs> you just ran into the door. So, how many do you have? One. Oh, I'm so sorry, sweetie. I'm sure it'll be better next year. Hey, girl. Any luck this year? It's okay. I'll be here for you. Come on. Let's get to class. Oh, look, it's the loser that never talks. Any words this year? I'll take that as a no. Oh, shut up, Olivia. Excuse me? Oh, look, the mute is all alone. No one to stand up for her this time. 
What's that? Did you want to say something? I thought so. Oh, honey, you're home. Did you have a good day at school? Do you want to talk about it? Oh, no, sorry, sweetie. I didn't mean... I can finally speak. Morning, honey. Good morning, mom. You're talking. I'll tell you all about it later. I'm going to school. Guess what? Wait, how are you talking? The system offered me to steal Olivia's words. Giselle, that's a criminal offense. Wait, what? Yeah, they can lock you up for it. I had no idea. I'm going to get into so much trouble. How does she even have infinite words? Hey, is it possible for somebody to have infinite words? Infinite words? No way. Well, Olivia did. Now I have them. Giselle, please report to the principal's office immediately. They know. Giselle, please report to the principal's office immediately. They know. Just relax, you don't know that. Go in there and act like you know nothing. I'll try. You can do this. Did you see me, Mr. Fitz? Yes, hi. I presume you know about Olivia's words? Yeah, I may have heard about it. Do you have any idea who might have stolen them? No, I have no idea. If you're lying to me, you're going to be in big trouble. I promise, I don't know anything. Okay then, be sure to let me know if you do. I will. What am I going to do though? I'm going to find out I'm lying and... Giselle? Olivia? I should have known it was you. No, no, this is all a big misunderstanding. Save it. You're going to be locked up for a long time. Wait. If I have your words, how are you talking? That doesn't concern you now, does it? The only important thing here is I found out who stole them. No, please, I can explain. Giselle, Olivia, come with me. Giselle, Olivia, come with me. I'm sorry, but who are you? I'm here regarding Olivia's words. We're going to sort this out. Okay. Where are we? Leave the questions to me. Did you or did you not steal Olivia's words? Well, yes I did, but it's not my fault. Stop lying. She did steal them. You better start telling the truth. How did you take them? The system offered me to steal them. That's impossible. I promise you I'm telling the truth. How many words did you steal? It says she had infinite. Well, that's impossible. Unless she's been stealing yours. Wait. So she's been stealing my words all along? Of course I have. And I would have gotten away with it too, if it wasn't for you. I can't believe this. I'm so sorry about the confusion, miss. It's okay. At least she's locked up now. We have taken away all of her words and given them back to you. Thank you. Happy birthday! Hope you like your gift! Gummy bears? Really, guys? They're magic! Each one gives you a different ability. Okay, let's see what the red one does. Hey, check it out! Someone left five bucks on the street. Wait, don't go over there. That car came out of nowhere! How did you know that was gonna happen? I, I don't know, I just did. Excuse me, Bria. Could I see you after class? You wanted to see me, Mr. Peters? Yes, I have an assignment for you. And it's not on paper, if you know what I mean. Actually, I have to go. Mom, I think we need to report my... What is he doing? Your little brother is building a tower. With bricks? No, wait, I think he's gonna... Oh no! Our table! It's broken! What color should I choose today? Hmm, just kidding. I already picked it. Let's go with blue. Hey, can I go to Jessica's party this weekend? No. Jessica is a bad influence on you. Mom, she's fine. Actually, she's fine. Okay, so can I go? No, I, I just said no. Oh, come on. Just let me go. Okay, sure, honey. You can go. I think I know what my ability is now. See ya. Hi, I'd like to return the shirt I bought here. Sure, do you have the receipt?
I don't. I actually lost it. Oh, yeah. No receipt, no refund. Oh, but it still has the tags on it, and I have the card that I used to pay for it. Yeah, don't care. I need the receipt, okay? Your new return policy is no receipt, no problem. So let's get that refund started, shall we? Your brother wants to play. Would you just forget about me? I have work to do. Hey, Tommy, I just want to say I'm sorry. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Wait a minute. What? Who are you? <gasps> Yesterday's ability was really weird, so let's go with purple today. Please don't be bad. <laughs> hey, Dad, I'm going to head to Jessica's party. Now, wait just a minute. Don't worry, Mom said I can go. I better let her have some fun before I break with the news about the divorce. Uh, you and Mom are getting a divorce? I didn't... Oh, no, you got mine reading today, didn't you? Sweetheart, you weren't supposed to find out like that. Good morning, Bria. Good morning, Mr. Peters. She's got such pretty eyes and a really cute butt. What a creep. Ew, there she is. I don't want to talk to her. Hi, bestie! Oh, don't bestie me. You are a fake friend. You know what? Take your friendship bracelet back. Ow! I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you in your face. Come here! <gasps> I can't believe she broke my freaking elbow. What are you looking at, Daryl? I don't care that you broke your elbow. Ah! <sighs> well, now that my elbow's finally healed, I'm going with green today. <laughs> well, what is that? Wait, can I control time? Oh, this is going to be fun. Why are you packing a suitcase? I'm moving out, honey, remember? Yeah, the divorce. You know, this whole thing isn't right. I know you still care about Mom. You just need to show her a little more. Now, before I unpause him, I'm going to give him this to hold for Mom. Perfect. Daniel, who prepared this dinner? Dad did. I did? I, I mean, uh, yeah. Oh, baby, this is really romantic. Okay, I don't need to see this. You ready for the talent show? Wait, that was today? Don't tell me you forgot. Of course not. <laughs> Taught myself how to play this in one hour, so let's hope it goes well. She's really good. Hey, Mommy. Can I ride the bus to school with my friends? No, honey, I'll walk you. Okay. Hey, Mom, can I go to the mall with Jessica? Her mom's taking us. You can go, but I'm driving you. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Hey, Mom, there's this school trip. Can I go? How long is the drive? About three hours. No, sorry, you can't go. Okay. Hey, Mom, I'm finally 16. Can I please learn how to drive? No. But both my sisters got to learn at my age. I said no. This is not fair. Hey girl, are you coming with us to Jackson's party tonight? I would love to, but I can. Ugh, is this about the whole driving thing? I'll take you. I have my license. You know what? Yeah. Pick me up at seven. I'll follow you into the park Through the jungle, through the dark Girl, I've never loved one like you Boats and boats and waterfalls Alleyways and payphone calls I've been everywhere with you That's true We laugh until we think we'll die Barefoot on a summer night Nothing new be sweeter than I'm with you And in the streets you're running free Like it's only you and Jeez, you're something to see Oh, honey, let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you Oh, honey, let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you You can only say yes. Yes. Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes. You really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment, do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes.
Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey, babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. You can only say no. No. Honey, do you want some breakfast? No. But it's your favorite chocolate chip pancakes. No. Are you okay? Should I call a doctor? No. Giselle, did you finish the assignment? No. Are you planning to finish it? No. And you just earned yourself detention? No. That's it. Go to the principal's office. Giselle, do you have a day to prom yet? No. I heard Chad's going to ask you. No. But I thought you were in love with Chad. <gasps> Giselle, he's coming. No, 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 no. Hey, Giselle. Will you go to prom with me? No. Is that a yes or a no? No. Whatever. I'm out of here. No. What is more useful when it is broken? It's an egg. It has to be an egg. No way. It's a glow stick. Say glow stick. So which is it? An egg. A glow stick. If I don't get this right, I'm going to die. The final decision is yours to make. An egg. Correct answer. An egg. Mom, I'm home. No, I got a riddle. You need to read it out loud. What is always in front of you but can't be seen? Right in front of you, but you can't see it. Air! It has to be air. It's always right in front of you, but nobody can see it. The answer, air. Incorrect. Correct answer, the future. Mommy's gone. I, I really thought I was right. <laughs> I got a riddle again. What can fly but has no wings? I, I don't know. I don't want to be wrong again. Please help. I can only live if there's light, but I die if a light shines on me. A shadow! A shadow! Correct answer, a shadow. <sighs> Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Sissy, I got a riddle. Hurry, read it to me. What can run but can't walk? A turkey? No, don't say turkey. Final answer. It's a river. It's a river. Are you sure? I think so. A river. Correct answer, a river. Oh, no. I just got a riddle. Hurry, read it out loud. We can all help you. What has 21 eyes but can't see? 21 eyes but can't see. Come on, give him suggestions. I don't know. I know the answer. It's 10 and a half blind people. Incorrect. Correct answer, a dice. Oh no, I got another riddle. What can fly but has no wings? I don't know. I don't want to be wrong again. Please help. Final answer. A ghost. Say ghost. Okay, No. Go it's time. Are you sure? Yes. The answer is time. Correct answer, time. I hate this game. I don't want to play. Sissy, you need to be strong, okay? Quitting isn't an option. I just got a riddle. What is always spelt wrong? That's an easy one. The answer is wrong. Wrong is always spelt wrong. Wrong? No, it can't be that simple. But what if it is? The answer is wrong. Correct answer, wrong. I just got a riddle. Hurry, Grandma, read it. What can clap with no hands? Clap with no hands? You're behind. No. I can only live if there's light, but I die if a light shines on me. A shadow, a shadow. Correct answer, a shadow. Bye, Mom. I'm off to school. Sissy, I got a riddle. Hurry, read it to me. What can run but can't walk? A turkey? No, don't say turkey. Final answer. It's a river. It's a river. Are you sure? I think so. A river. Correct answer, a river. Oh, no. I just got a riddle. Hurry, read it out loud. We can all help you. What has 21 eyes but can't see? 21 eyes but can't see. Come on, give him suggestions! I don't know. I know the answer. It's ten and a half blind people. 
Incorrect. Correct answer, a dice. Oh no, I got another riddle. Time to take your vitamins. Mom, do I have to? They make my head hurt. That means they're working. What exactly are they doing for me? Shh, open. Mom, stop, I can take it myself. Okay, let me see. Good job. Next one's at lunch. Yeah, okay, I know, you're gonna make me late. Hey, cool if I sit here for lunch? Sure. Why does no one talk to you? Um, FaceTime from Mom. I'm really sorry, but I have to take this, um, in private. Mom, oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Look, I just need to see you take it. There, are you happy? Yes, good job, honey. I love you. Why? This is why I'm never gonna have any friends. <laughs> hey, what the hell? Where did you come from? They're after me. There isn't much time. You need to stop taking those vitamins. They're... Stop taking those vitamins. They're suppressing your powers. Powers? Yes, you're a special just like your father. A what? How do you know my father? I'm out of time. Just don't take those pills tonight and you'll see what happens. No, wait! <laughs> okay, it's time. Good job, honey. You just earned yourself some dessert. She's gotta stop treating me like I'm five. Kara, vitamin time. Okay, I'm coming. Go on, take it. What's wrong? Kara, don't tell her anything. She can't be trusted. Honey, what? Uh, nothing. Never mind. Uh-huh. Well, don't be late to class now. Bye, Mom. No, Kara, wait. I found your vitamins in the trash. Why were they in the trash? The better question is, why are you making me take them? I know they're not really vitamins. How do you know that? I just... I just know, okay? Damn it. Derek found you, didn't he? Who? Never mind. You have to take them. No, Mom. I'm going to school. Don't tell me no. You will take them. I know what's best. Open your mouth. No, you... You stay back. Oh, You are in so much... I know I have powers. Honey, you don't even know how to use them. <laughs> yeah, I do. Just watch. <laughs> Come on. Work. Ow. I'm sorry, Kara, but I have to do this to protect you. Oh, okay, just stay there. Can you hear me, Mom? It's all right. Open your mouth. Mom, no. Mm. <laughs> Kara? <laughs> yes, my plan worked. Hey, it's all right. You're safe now. Dad? Dad? Kara, you look so grown up. Yeah. No shit. You left when I was eight. I was forced to leave you, Kara. I was being hunted. Hunted? By who? Ultra. An organization set on eliminating our kind. It was your mom's biggest fear that you would become a special. A special as in having special powers? Yes. We think you might be the most powerful out of all of us. I don't think I can trust you guys. I don't even know how I got here. All of us specials are connected. Somehow you knew subconsciously to teleport here. My dad was a special too, and Ulta killed him. And they would have gotten me as well if it weren't for your dad. Please, I just want to keep you safe. Specials have either teleportation, telepathy, or telekinesis. We think you have all three. Okay, so how do I learn how to use them? Now use your telepathy to put a number in Derek's mind. Are you saying five? Yes. She really has all three powers. I want to try teleportation now. Hold on, that one's hard. I just want to try it. Kara, wait. <laughs> Honey? Vandaag gaan een goeie dag wees. Wacht. Hoe kom dat ik hier die vreemde tol? Mama? Mama, asjeblief help. Ik praat hier die vreemde tol en ik weet niet hoe kom nie. Honey, that's your soulmate's language. My seelsgenootse tol? Yes, and you'll only be able to speak English again once you meet him. Wonderlijk. Ik is geskroef. Hey Giselle. Goeiemorgen Jessica. Why are you speaking Afrikaans? This need my skills me. My seals gonna throw you the tall. Girl, you're gonna struggle to find him. Yo, this what I could think it. Come, on to class two. Giselle, can you give me the answer to number seven? Um, yo, I could get crying here in six days. I'm afraid I don't understand. By the way, class, we're getting a new student today. He's an exchange student from South Africa, so please be nice. Giselle, can you give me the answer to number seven? Um, ja, ek het gekry 69. I'm afraid I don't understand. By the way, class, we're getting a new student today. He's an exchange student from South Africa, so please be nice.
Girl, did you see the new guy? Isn't he so cute? Yo, Kate. In witte van waarof is hij? Yeah, he's from South Africa. In wat praat hulle in Suid-Afrika? They speak Afrikaans. Wait, that means he's your... Yep. In ons het winner. Giselle, this literally means the new kid is your soulmate. Ja, jy het uiteindelik twee en twee by mekaar gesit. You have to go talk to him. Is jy mal? Ek gaan nie met hom praat nie, ek is te sien of jy achtig. You're gonna have to get over it because he's on his way here. Hey, um, I'm Michael. Giselle, this literally means the new kid is your soulmate. Ja, jy het uiteindelik twee en twee by mekaar gesit. You have to go talk to him. Is jy mal? Ek gaan nie met hom praat nie, ek is te sien of jy achtig. Well, you're gonna have to get over it because he's on his way here. Hey, I'm Michael. And you are? Oh, you can't speak? No, she can... No, apparently she can't. Girl, I can't believe you just did that. What anders moes ek doen? Ek ste bang om met hom te praat. Well, if you don't talk to him, you're never gonna be able to speak English again. Ja, ek weet. If you don't go talk to him today, I'm gonna tell him you were lying. Alright, alright. Ek sal met hom praat. Good choice. Hallo, um, jy het gesê jou naam is Michael? Wait, you're speaking Afrikaans? That means you're my... Hallo, um, jy het gesê jou naam is Michael? Wait, you're speaking Afrikaans. That must mean you're my... Jou sielsgenoot? Exactly, but... Why are you still speaking Afrikaans and I'm still speaking English? Now that you're the noom, yeah, this is nogal vreemd. I wonder how you can nog steeds Afrikaans and you nog steeds Engels. I don't know, but it's really weird. I can gaan probeer uit vind. Jessica, can I go with you praat? Yeah, girl, what's up? Okay, I can met Michael gepraat, maar ek praat nog steeds Afrikaans. Giselle, that just means he's not your soulmate. Wie anders is dit dan? Ek ken niemand anders wat Afrikaans is nie. Did you know that Michael has a brother? Wacht wat? Het hy een boete? Yeah, I just met him this morning. Jessica, kan ek gaan met jou praat? Yeah girl, what's up? Ok so, ek het met Michael gepraat, maar ek praat nog steeds Afrikaans. Giselle, that just means he's not your soulmate. Wel, as dit nie hy is nie, wie is dit dan? Ek ken niemand anders wat Afrikaans praat nie. Well, did you know Michael has a brother? Wacht, wat? Het hy een boete? Yeah, I just met him this morning. Denk jy, dis talk hy? There's one way you could find out. Ok, waar kan ek hom kry? I think he's in the cafeteria. Ok, ek gaan met hom gaan praat. Giselle, there you are. I've been looking for you. Michael, hallo. Um, ek soek eindelijk jou boete. Ek moet met hom praat. Why do you want to speak with my brother? Ek wil jou nie seer maak nie, maar ek denk jou boete is dalk my sielsgenoot. That's impossible, it's me. Hey, I'm Jake, I'm Michael's brother. Hi, I'm Giselle. Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo? Marco? Safe. Emily! I'm so glad I found you, sissy. I was so scared, it was so dark. Marco! Polo! <laughs> you actually fell for it. Bestie, don't scare me like that. Chill, I was just joking. It's serious. My little sister Emily was chosen to play the game this morning. She almost didn't find me in time. <laughs> What's wrong with Cynthia? Her boyfriend died during the game of Marco Polo. He wasn't able to find her in time. That's awful. Everything's dark. Oh no. Marco? Everything's dark. Oh no. Marco? Polo! Marco! Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Thank goodness you found me. I'm so glad you weren't far. Choose who will play. They're making me choose? Well, I can't choose my mother. Marco? Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo? Polo! Bestie, why can't I hear you? Polo! Marco! Polo! Failure. <laughs> choose. You're making me choose again. Oh. You're up early. Unfortunately. Honey, I need a favor. Kit. What the? 
You drive your sister to school to... Day. Hey, when did you change your clothes? Get back here. This is a robbery. What? First thing in the morning? Give me your car keys now. <laughs> oh. Oh, uh, Brianna, you're late. You'll only have 10 minutes left to write the test. Don't worry. Just hand me the test. I got this. Come on. We've been paused long enough. Can you press play now? Come on. We've been paused long enough. Can you press play now? How are you not paused but everybody else is? I don't know why, but I have the same ability as you. I can pause time. You must be the chosen ones. I'm sorry, but this is real life, not Star Wars. Wait a minute. So if you press pause, it stops time not only for you, but for me too? This restaurant you brought me is amazing. You know I know how to treat a lady. Let's kiss. Why aren't you breathing? James! Okay, I can't wait any longer. I'm leaving. Hey, can I ask you something? Sure, what? Well, I just think you're super fine and- Brianna, hurry up and unpause it before I lose my riz! Um, I'm not paused. What? Please wish for me to pass my test. What? No, leave me alone. How do you have one wish left? Everyone used theirs up as kids. Well, I was a very smart child and I saved mine. Hey, looking nice today. Do you want to sit next to me for lunch or... You know, my car broke down today. Oh, so this is why you wanted to sit with me. No, I mean, I wanted to... Save it, Grayson. You just want to use me like everyone else. Can you please wish for... Stop it. Everywhere I go, people are asking me for wishes, like I'm some sort of genie. So you know what? I wish for everyone to have three more wishes. Hey, I didn't get any more. What happened? I wish for you to stop talking. Mmm. I have unlimited wishes. Bro, she can give us anything we want. <gasps> get her! She has infinite wishes. Get her. I wish I was home. Honey, you're home early. Yeah, I actually got unlimited. Uh-huh, that's nice. Are you even listening to me? Sorry, can't hear you. I wish for her to take her AirPods off and to smash them on the floor. <gasps> Why did I just do that? Hey, it's Wish Girl. I have a name. Yeah, but no one cares. Now give us wishes. Oh, I don't think so. I wish for everyone at this school to forget that I have unlimited wishes. Wait, what was I talking to you about? Don't move. I wish. Uh-uh. Don't even think about it. Read what's on the paper. I am not reading this. Read it or things are gonna get ugly. I wish to become a genie? Great. Now come with me. Where are we? Your new home. What? How do you even know me? Someone at your school told me yesterday. Oh man, I should have wished for everyone to forget sooner. You're gonna give me wishes. Not gonna happen. Oh, yes it is. I wish to be a billionaire. You must hold hand to activate wish. Oh, okay. Come here. No way. I just got a billion dollars in my account. Now I wish for a horse. <laughs> nice. Now I wish for a Rolex watch. Can I please take a break now? I'm tired. You're lucky I'm a nice guy. All right, you can have a little break. Come on. You know, when I said I wanted to sit down, this wasn't what I meant. Enough complaining. Don't make me wish for you not to speak. <sighs> what am I going to do? I wish that I was free. Error. You may only grant wishes for others. Psst, Melanie. Grayson, what are you doing here? I saw that guy take you, so I followed you. Why didn't you just call the police? Oh, maybe I should have done that. Okay, I'll go call them right now. No, 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 wait. Actually, you can help me. All you have to do is just say one wish. What? A wish? Just wish for me not to be a genie anymore. But everyone used up all their- Damn it, Grayson. Just repeat after me. I wish- I wish- For Melanie to not be a genie anymore. For Melanie not to be a genie anymore. Hey, I wish for him to disappear. That's not gonna work. I wish I was free. Out of wishes. Okay, guess that's not gonna work either. <laughs> Grayson, a little help, please. What are you gonna do, kid, huh? I was thinking of doing this. Oh, that's what you get, creep. You okay? Yeah. Oh, here. The cops found these on him. Thanks. I guess those Taekwondo classes really paid off. Yeah, but can you explain what the genie stuff was all about? You know, I wish I could, but I think it's best if I don't. Come on, please don't be anything bad. Okay, how was that a curse? I mean, we basically read each other's minds anyways. 
So do I tell her I can read her mind now? Nah, I don't want to creep her out. That's kind of weird. Hey. Hey. How does she look so nice today? You look so pretty today, too. I mean, you look so pretty every day, honestly. Um, thanks? She's totally lying. Why would she think I was lying to her? Bye, babe. I'll see you tomorrow. You guys are so cute. I have to get my new breakup. I can't wait to get a boyfriend out of the picture. Then she'll be all mine. I don't understand why she would be thinking all this stuff. Unless maybe she likes me. Does this mean she's going to try and ruin my relationship with Chris? I'm overthinking. There's no way this Amber Alert's for him. Breaking news, a teenage boy has been reported missing tonight. Jace? Hey girl, how are you? Not good. Didn't you hear the news about Jace? No. Macy, he's missing. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? I gotta get to class. I think she might have Jace. That's it. I have to go talk to her. You wanted to talk to me? Uh, yeah, and, um, listen, this is kind of hard to say, but I know that you like me. And there's nothing wrong with that. It's just... Good. She doesn't like her. She doesn't like It's just... It's just that I have a boyfriend? Mm, well, he's missing. Four mil or a hair clip? Come on, who in their right mind would choose the... Achoo! No! At least it's kind of cute. I can't come to your party. But you promised. I know, I'm so sorry. <sighs> come on, girl, you're like the mutual friend. If you don't come, then no one else is gonna want to come. Look, my parents said no. She doesn't want to come to your party because she doesn't like you. You sure that's the reason? Yes, I wouldn't lie, okay? Goodbye. Mom says you have to take me to the mall. She's lying. Your mom just grounded her. Mom just grounded you? How did you know that? You weren't even home when it happened. I don't know. I just did, okay? Now, get out. Ugh, whatever. Does this hair clip tell me the truth about people? Hey, babe, I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. Hey, babe, I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. If he doesn't work for Walmart, then where does he... I'm following him. What is he doing here? This place looks super sketchy. What do you think you're doing, huh? Come here. Hey, boss, look who I found snooping around here. Babe, what, what is going on? Babe, you know this girl? I've never seen her before in my life. I'm sorry, did our two years together just mean nothing to you? Two years? Have you been keeping secrets from me? I told you, you know what the rules are. He's trying to protect you by lying. He works for very dangerous men. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. He's lying to protect you. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. <laughs> you see, sir, I would kill her, but you know, I don't want to mess up this new shirt, so- Either you kill her, or him and I will do it ourselves. No, please. Look, let's just all settle down. You just- I think I'm gonna need a change of clothes. Really, babe? The Mafia? You're lucky I find that kind of attractive. Well, I know a place we can lay low. I bet. But we gotta be careful who we trust. I have something that can help with that. Ooh, another day, another charge. <clears throat> what? Mom, I need to borrow your charger. No, I'm using it. I'm only at 10%. I'm going to die. Here, hurry up. <clears throat> it's not working. Let's try this. That's the emergency charger. This is an emergency. <clears throat> it didn't work. There must be something wrong with my charging port. Did I hear something wrong with the charging port? Hold still. Hold what? <laughs> what happened? 
You made it worse. I'm at 2% now. There's one more thing we can try. Come with me. Wait. So, you need more charge? Yeah, my dad says you know what to do. <laughs> I have just the thing. Dad, this guy seems sketchy. Put this to your charging port, and whatever you do, don't move. Wait, why can't I move? No question, just do it. I am tired of getting electrocuted. Look at your energy. 200%? But that's not even possible. I have so much energy. I feel so great. My energy hasn't went down all day. Not even 1%. That's great, but maybe you should take a break, Brianna. Not a chance. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. I feel great. Are you sure? Oh, yes, I really do. My energy is at its max, and I am loving it. Woo! Uh-oh, you got a mark. Five mistakes and you're out. Out? Like... <laughs> yes, exactly. Two plus two. Brianna, what's the answer? Um... I can't answer it. I don't want to make a mistake. I know the answer. It's three. <laughs> that was Timmy's fifth mistake. Five mistakes and you're out. Brianna, hold this. What is wrong with you? Why would you give that to me to hold when I wasn't ready? Chill out. It's no big deal. No, I can't chill out. I have two marks now. Three more and I'm out. Giving her that to hold was a mistake. What? How is that a mistake? Was it a mistake? Brianna, if you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Was it a mistake? Brianna, if you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Um. No, that's my last mistake. You still have three left. It was her mistake. Not mine. <sighs> hey, guys. You can't sit with us. Why not? For the reason Sophie's dead. You let her die so you didn't get another mark. Why should I get a mark? I wasn't the one who made a mistake. Five marks and you're out. You're so selfish. Your shoelaces are untied. Hmm? Why would you do that? Sir, she made a mistake. She forgot to tie her shoelaces and then she tripped. What? No, you tripped me. You're now the school's target. That's what you get for killing Sophie. You're going to be next. Happy birthday, darling. How many days do you have, darling? Only three days. No, we must find you a husband at once. Ready to choose? No, this isn't fair. I don't know any of these men. You can get to know them after you've been wed. Now pick one. All right, let's see. Not him. But definitely not him. What? Next. But I. And let me guess, this one has a great personality. <laughs> you have offended all the princes. Wow, that was one brutal elimination. And who might you be? Prince Nathaniel. But don't worry. I'm not here to ask you for your hand in marriage. Then why are you here? Mostly for entertainment. Aren't you from the rival kingdom? Indeed I am, and I can't wait to tell my father how hot-headed your daughter is. Aubrey, don't. All the princes rejected you. Good, I do not wish to marry any of them. If you do not wed in three days, you shall die. Are you certain that if I don't marry in three days, I shall die? Yes. You have to say yes to the first man who proposes. No, that isn't fair. Life isn't fair, darling. I can't do this. You must. I will not lose you like I lost your father. You must find a husband. Do you understand? Oh, mother, I think my corset is a bit too tight. Aubrey, to meet a good suitor, you must look as fitted as possible. Hello, princess. Would you care to dance? That was fun. Shall we dance again? Oh, actually, I'm a bit thirsty. Say no more. I shall fetch you a drink, your highness. <gasps> Pardon me. I didn't mean to startle you. You weren't invited. The invitation said all eligible princes were welcome. Are you alright? My corset, it's... it's too tight. My corset, it's... it's too tight. Hang on, I'll help you. Is that better? Yes, thank you. Princess? What exactly was happening over here? It is not what it looks like. I was simply helping her with her dress. You two were being scandalous. No! We don't even like each other. 
I'm so telling everyone. You can't just go around spreading rumors about us. Hmm. You could marry her and restore your dignity, or... Is there a second option? You could also pay me to keep quiet. <laughs> I can't believe we paid her so much money. This is all your fault. My fault? You're the one who... Princess, there you are. I must ask you a question. Will you, Princess Aubrey, marry me? I... Your mother insisted I ask you tonight. So, what do you say, Princess? Yes. Excellent. We shall be married tomorrow, and you shall be saved from death. Nathaniel, why are you here? I came to congratulate you on your engagement. You know, for a guy who doesn't like me, you sure show up at my palace a lot. Are you implying that I might have feelings for you? I would do no such thing, Your Highness, unless, of course, it was true. I think you've mistaken my generosity for affection. You are far from generous. Oh, really? Yes, really. I'll have you know I can be very generous. All right, then prove it. All right. I will. You kissed me. I... I would never. I am a gentleman. A gentleman does not kiss another man's bride. You have to marry me. No, Aubrey, I can't. Is it because we are rivals? No. I have to go. Now, after we are wed, I want the princess taken care of. I shall pay for you to do this. We have postponed the wedding long enough. He is trying to kill me. Enough of your nonsense. You shall be married tonight. And do you take Prince Frederick to be your husband? I... Stop the wedding. That man is a fraud. Nathaniel, someone get this fool out of here. The only fool here is you. Prince Frederick is not who he claims to be. In fact, he's not a prince at all. It's true. You were just using her to become royalty. No. I am a man of honor. No, Frederick. What you are is a word I dare not say in front of the queen. Whoa. Aubrey, I'm so sorry. You are almost out of time. Who shall you marry? Marry me. But I thought... I made a vow to never marry because I didn't believe in love. That was until... Until what? Until I met you. So I ask you, Aubrey... Will you join our kingdoms together and marry me? Yes. I pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss. Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo? Marco? Safe. Emily! I'm so glad I found you, sissy. I was so scared. It was so dark. Marco! Polo! <laughs> you actually fell for it. Bessie, don't scare me like that. Chill, I was just joking. It's serious. My little sister Emily was chosen to play the game this morning. She almost didn't find me in time. <laughs> What's wrong with Cynthia? Her boyfriend died during the game of Marco Polo. He wasn't able to find her in time. That's awful. Everything's dark. Oh no. Marco? Everything's dark. Oh no. Marco? Polo! Marco! Marco! Polo! Marco! Polo! Thank goodness you found me. I'm so glad you weren't far. Choose who will play. They're making me choose? Well, I can't choose my mother. Marco? Polo! Marco! Polo! Polo? Polo! Bestie, why can't I hear you? Polo! Marco! Polo! Failure. <laughs> choose. You're making me choose again. Oh. You're up early. Unfortunately. Honey, I need a favor. Can what the? You drive your sister to school to day. Hey, when did you change your clothes? Get back here. This is a robbery. What? First thing in the morning? Give me your car keys now. Ah! Oh. <coughs> oh. Uh Brianna, you're late. You'll only have 10 minutes left to write the test. Don't worry. Just hand me the test. I got this. Come on. We've been paused long enough. Can you press play now? Come on, we've been paused long enough. Can you press play now? 
How are you not paused, but everybody else is? I don't know why, but I have the same ability as you. I can pause time. You must be the chosen ones. I'm sorry, but this is real life, not Star Wars. Wait a minute. So if you press pause, it stops time not only for you, but for me too? This restaurant you brought me is amazing. You know I know how to treat a lady. Let's kiss. Why aren't you breathing? James! Okay, I can't wait any longer. I'm leaving. Hey, can I ask you something? Sure, what? Well, I just think you're super fine and... Brianna, hurry up and unpause it before I lose my riz. Um, I'm not paused. What? Happy birthday, we got you something. I think I know what it is. An iPhone 4 Hello, pencils. pencils. Really? Honey, they're magic pencils. Right. Class, write this down. Purple power unlocked. Hey, babe, do you mind if we take a rain check on our date this week? Are you nervous? <laughs> what, what? No, of course not. Are you hiding something from me? Crap, I can't do this anymore. I cheated on you, okay? I'm sorry. I feel so bad you and your boyfriend broke up. This tells me people's emotions. You're not sad. I don't know what you're talking about. She was jealous of us. I knew it. Hey, um, where's mom? She's outside with Coco, giving her a lecture about listening. Coco, when mommy says stop, you say okay. I just a baby! Mom, you might not want to talk to her right now. But you still have to say okay, mom. I just a baby! I think today I'm going to go with red. Red power unlocked. I get to see people's ages. Well, this will be interesting. Hey, good morning, girly. You're 20? What? How did you find out? Never mind that, but why are you still in high school? I failed. I got held back. Hey, it's okay. Your secret is safe with me. Hey, I'm new. Is it cool if I sit here? Yeah, of course. Thanks. So, how old are you? Me? Oh, uh, I just turned 17 about, like, uh, two months ago. Psst, hey, what? Do you believe in vampires? No, why? Because I think I'm sitting next to one. Huh? You're funny. I'm telling you, he's a hundred years old. Can you watch my bag? I gotta use the restroom. Yeah, sure. See, he's- Girl, what are you doing? Looking for evidence. Ew, what is that? I think this is- What the hell, dude? What are you doing with my stuff? What are you doing with my stuff? Well, I think the better question is, what are you doing with this? That's for my lunch. It's strawberry jam. Oh! <laughs> Can I have my stuff back? Yeah, sorry. Yesterday's power was kind of a disaster, so today I think I'm going to go with green. Green power unlocked. Let's hope this power helps me figure out if that guy is a vampire or not. Hey, so I just wanted to apologize about yesterday. You're good. I actually think you're kind of cute. <laughs> How old did you say you were again? 17. I'm throwing a party tonight. Want to come? Yeah, sure. I would love that. Sweet. I'll airdrop you my address. Hey, you made it. Yeah, but where is everyone? They're on their way. Hey, Mom, this is the girl I was telling you about. Ooh, she looks beautifully delicious. Stop it. Really, I could just eat you. Oh, no. Try my punch, darling. The flavor is to die for. Get back. I'm leaving. Wait. I have two vampires after me. This calls for some extreme powers. What would happen if I just picked all of them? Are you sure you want to combine all the pencil's power? I have to. Which mode activated? There you are. Please, don't be scared. I know you know I'm a vampire, and I'm sorry about lying about the party. Your mom was trying to kill me. I was just trying to hang out with you alone. I didn't realize she was going to act like that. She has bloodlust. I wish you were a vampire so you could understand. Wish granted. What just happened? I think you just turned me into a vampire. How is that even possible? Because I have a secret too, okay? I have magic colored pencils, and I think you just used the last of their power. You don't have to worry about my mom killing you anymore. Thank you, because that makes me feel so much better. Hey, since I did this to you, I promise I'll protect you. I'll teach you how to be a great...